my dear brothers and sisters devotees of infant jesus i don't think you require much explanation for the passage that we read isn't it because if at all we see our own life our own christian family surround and only in mangalore if you ask the court you know the cases we are in india what is the percentage what is the percentage of christians in india hmm yeah around two more or less right but in mangalore court highest number of cases are of christians you believe highest number of divorce cases are of christians property issues christians those who are seated here including me if we see our own life how many cases we may be having or struggling with the same thing maybe for the property maybe for a fight maybe of divorce and we are struggling we are paying we are paying to the lawyer and we know nothing is going to happen soon not ready to forgive or reconcile this is why as we realize our own life as we analyze or introspect our own past we can raise a question very simple question i was very close to my mother i mean all of us playing with my mummy being naughty cracking jokes running here and there sometime trying to cheat telling lies that was the childhood as we grew we develop the beautiful relationship with mummy and now as you are seated here what is your relationship with your mother is it because of one simple word of hatred is it because of your arrogance is it because of your anger you spoke one sentence or she spoke one sentence and you are till now not at all in touch with your mummy who is the source or the reason to come to this earth are you trying to understand if at all you are not able to contact your mummy say i love you mummy after having experienced so much of love warmth if the words that we will say are insulting brothers and sisters my humble request it's better not to say them any more and you know if they are hurting you they are also hurting others it's better to simply shut our mouths be quiet and let the anger be cured only by love not by words therefore let us remember that insulting words the way we speak whenever we are angry the way we react deeply hurts the receiver and it causes a permanent emotional wound in his or her being so why do we say such words why are we very quick to insult and belittle the other this is primarily brought about by our arrogance bloated ego and the feeling of our own superiority we feel we are little superior we have grown little and we feel we have some kind of authority and therefore we are ready even to insult the other what is the cure jesus is saying i am the cure follow me if we will follow jesus and we allow him in our own lives definitely he will cleanse us of our arrogance egoism and feeling of superiority my humble request brothers let and sisters let us be forgiving humble and gentle if at all during this mass if you are disturbed and you feel yes i must forgive my brother not because i have done something 
even gospel says if you feel he is not fine with you he is not okay he has done something wrong you show him that as christian we do not value the cases the issues the difficulties or the problems or the concepts but we value our relationship we value a brother who is here given by god as a gift to me we value a sister we value a mother we value a father not these small small issues and i tell you that hug that one kiss that one smile those loving words will be far greater worth or of value than going to the court than fighting than seeking influence amen